I said it before and I'm gonna say it again the 40 beheaded babies I would love to see their parents and uh, would like to send them my condolences because uh, this is horrific the 40 innocent imaginary babies and their imaginary parents I think uh, everybody who supports uh, Israel at this very point, despite knowing that uh, the 40 babies uh, hoax was uh, propaganda and then the raped women and then the false uh, cutting of uh, body parts and nonsense that they came up with to start this uh, horrific genocide, this has to stop. And everybody who supports Israel at this very point is supporting child killers, is supporting genocide and would have definitely supported their hero Hitler at that point as well and I even said that last time that uh, I'm 100% sure that these people who are pro-Israelis at this very point would have actually won, uh, been the ones that uh, pressed the buttons or pulled the lever when it comes to um, getting the gas chamber to be activated 100% because uh, you people have shown that you only only think that the white supremacy is um, the most important thing to define who we should support and who sh uh, we should not that's that's exactly what it is you guys think that uh, anybody who is a different skin tone than yours is uh, not worth fighting for but um, we have lots of white people with us now and when I say we I mean everybody even those people who are ethnically uh, not Palestinians and who are not the same culture they are seeing the barbaric killings of innocent children women elderly and the disabled in Palestine and if you still support uh, Israel after this I have absolutely not a single cell of sympathy if you ever go through the same thing because uh, that's exactly what karma is all about you will go through something similar if not a war then something is gonna happen in your life that's gonna make you realize that I was on the wrong side